Hi there guys. Uh, today is actually um, November 24th is actually um, Thanksgiving's Day. So um, for those who may celebrate that and spend time with family and all that, you know, um, just wish you a safe time with that. Um, it's not really something I um, celebrate, um, but either way, you know, for whatever reason, you may or may not still I hope you have a great and wonderful day. Um, this particular video is it's just going to be really short and it's actually going to be uh, with me just kind of telling you what's going to be coming up. Um, here in the next few weeks, um, I'm not really sure how many videos I'm going to make. I think that I'm going to make it a, uh, a uh, series. Think what I'm going to do. Um, focused on the black woman, you know. Um, without going into too much of it, I mean, the black woman period uh, just really, really gets a bum rap right now, and we know that, you know. Um, the black woman really right now gets a lot of a uh, uh, lot coming at her, you know, on every hand. Uh, most of it. If we are honest, it's just really not positive. Um, a lot of it, it's, it's, it, you know, in my opinion, being a black woman is a lot of propaganda. A lot of it is uh, very, very stereotypical and uh, just really here to damage and destroy her image uh, of who she is, who she's been historically, and who she's going to be again. Um, I know and believe that the black woman has a great and plays a great part. Uh, not only in America, but in the world, in nature, in everything. And so, um, you know, that, that's one of the reasons why the image is being destroyed. But it's, it's not going to be a successful campaign. It's a hardworking campaign. I mean, all you really have to do is uh, go and look at YouTube and you'll see all of the bashing, all of the hateful, hurtful videos that uh, people share about the black woman, you know. Uh, and like I say, you know, the way I look at it, it with the push being so, uh, it's, it's such a driven push. It's, it's such a, um, I mean, it's just like almost, I mean, so many people out there just bashing, bashing, bashing the black woman until you, you know that it's a campaign. I mean, it's like, it's so it's so heavily out there until you know that this is a campaign, you know. So anyway, that's not going to be what I focus on. What I'm going to focus on is positive. What I'm going to focus on is um, the black woman getting up, doing for herself, beginning to be selfish. Um, that's going to be huge. That's going to be one of the first videos that I talk about. Um, you know, we hear so much about the black woman being a gold digger. And, oh, she, just, she always wants money. And she's... You, no, the black woman is so very underrated. The black woman tirelessly gives up herself. She always puts herself in the back burner. Uh, and she sacrifices herself uh, for family, community, children. You know, um, the black woman is just really, really uh, very underrated, very unappreciated. That's the word I'm looking for. And so we're going to talk about health. We're going to talk about finances. We're going to talk about all of this because all of these things are going to play a role in the black woman changing her mindset and beginning to pull herself up because we see the way things are going. No one else is going to do it if we don't do it for ourselves and if we don't do it together as sisters. Uh, it has to be done. It needs to be done. The black woman has to heal in order to heal mankind and everyone else. We know the black woman is the mother of all. She's the original mother. And so um, the original mother needs to be healed. I mean, it's just like uh, Mama Africa. She's been so raped, so hurt, so destroyed. You know, um, she's not done. It's not over by a long shot, but it, it's indicative of, of what is happening to the black woman worldwide, being raped, being hurt, being abused. Uh, being stepped on and talked on, uh, talked about and just um, not out by a long shot. You know, the black woman still 
has plenty to give, but has to begin with her taking care of herself, has to begin with her beginning to change her mind about things that, that, that she's been taught, you know, uh, some of it, so much of it is just the way she's been taught. A lot of other women in other cultures have been taught things differently. The black woman really has only been taught how to survive and how to just make it another day. And so we're going to talk about that. We're going to discuss that. We're going to try to change some of that, some of those ideals. And, you know, we're going to move forward. We're going to go for it. We're not going to let anything stop us and hold us back and tell us we can't and tell us we aren't and everything. So um, I want you all to look forward to those videos um, coming up soon. Uh, to those um, to those um, helpful hints that I'm going to be giving. I'm no, once again, no expert on it. It's just that I have life experience and I know and I love my sisters and I love uh, the black community. And, um, you know, it's going to start with healing the mother. You know, there there's a saying that, that says if, if mama's not happy, nobody's happy. And right now mama ain't happy. Mama hasn't been happy for a long time, but we're going to get Mama happy. And um, anyway, you guys, uh, thanks for watching this video. Um, you all have a great day, great rest of the day. Uh, and uh, to the next video, you all be safe. Don't drink and drive. Enjoy your family. Kiss your loved ones. Kiss your children. Kiss the babies. All of them. The elders, you know, are so important. Because it could be that they not made the same elders that are here this year may not be here next year. So give them a hug, give them a kiss, let them know you love them. And uh, to the next video, you have a great day.